Good afternoon, everybody. Well, actually, it's nighttime, but it's still daylight here in Florida. It's 8.03 here in Florida, and I just want to come on with a special video tonight. And um, this is for a young man. He started his YouTube channel, it, it looks like in 2015, and um, he's a very, very wonderful young man, and he believes in the Lord Jesus Christ, and uh, I'm sorry guys, I have been out pretty much all day and doing stuff and this and that and the other, and I didn't get a chance to look at my comments and just, until about an hour ago, and I've been answering them um, as we speak, and... Uh, first, I'd like to say thank you, God's gift. You are a blessing, sweetheart. Uh, she stepped in um, and answered Ashley. Uh, his name is Ashley Spitzer. Um, he is a young young man. Young, I believe he's probably in his teens, um, somewhere along the lines there. Um, and he was curious about um the start he asked the start of what well i just want to explain that to you sweetheart but first i'm going to um read out another comment that he put because god's gift was answering him and i do appreciate that so much i really really do see now that's that's what we're here for guys is to take care of one another to love one another and it's almost bringing tears to my eyes <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Okay, I need to stop. <laughs> All right. Um, uh, Ashley responds to God's gift and says, Thank you, and I saw your message in my comments below. Try to make videos for my channel. It's hard. Is the tribulation about to start, though? I can't wait. My family from spiritual sleep, no matter how hard I try to how hard I try to warn them what is to come. My family are Christians that remain in spiritual sleep. They rather focus on things in the news um, and not what's truly going on and what is to come. Well, you know what, Ashley, you're absolutely right, sweetheart. It is really hard. And then we have God's gift, and she did answer Ashley and uh, she said to him, uh, all of us that are awake are in the same situation. We can tell our family, but only the Holy Spirit of God will wake them. And you're absolutely right, um, Ashley. All we can do, I mean, God's gift, all we can do is plant seeds in love. Just talk to them in love about Jesus here and there and and what I've offered sometimes to certain people is, you know, those little sticky notes that stick to things with the little um, glue on the back of them? What you could do is, is you could put little sticky notes like a verse on your refrigerator every day and um, just remind them that, you know, God loves them and like John 3.16 and just certain verses that you could put up there. Um, and just to let them know that, um, you know, Jesus loves them and that things are getting ready to uh, progress. And what I mean by that, sweetheart, is, well, anyways, I'm going to read God's gifts. Well, did I finish it? Oh, she says, um, Ashley, all of us are awake, all of us that are awake, are in the same situation we can tell our family but only the Holy Spirit of God will wake them and then she says do not worry about them just pray God hears our prayers remember the Bible tells us he didn't lose not one trust God in all things so that is awesome advice says that is awesome advice yeah take that advice uh, advice Ashley and um, just uh, like I said, just keep trying to nudge them a little bit. And if they do believe in Jesus, don't worry about their salvation, honey. They're sealed to the day of redemption. That means that no matter what, that when the rapture happens, and that will probably be right when the tribulation is happening, okay, or a little bit before or a little bit after it starts, 
um, because we're not appointed to wrath, Ashley. Okay, honey, we are not, uh, we are God's children. We are his adopted children through the confession of our faith from our hearts. So you are safe. Your family is safe if they've confessed Jesus as their Savior and they believe in God. They're just fine. Don't worry about them, sweetheart. And as far as the tribulation period goes, well, that is a period where um, the Lord is trying to wake up Israel, you know, the nation of Israel and the remnant of it, and to bring them back to God. And during this uh, seven-year period, if you want to look in Daniel 9, 27, it says that the Antichrist will make a covenant, will make a treaty with many, many that means many people, for, for seven, and that means for seven years. Now, that is the tribulation period. When it's going to start, none of us really know, sweetheart. But what we can do is that it says in the last days that the Lord says that he will pour out his spirit on all living flesh. And your old men will dream dreams, and your young men will see visions. Well, this is happening in the body of Christ right now. And even with people that aren't saved, God is trying to let them know, hey, it's getting ready to happen. Wake up. I'm talking about the ones that aren't saved, okay? He, he's trying to let them know, please listen to me, okay? Uh, and so if you sound like you've accepted Jesus and you're just fine. Don't even worry about that. You're going directly to heaven. So is your little brother, <laughs> I did see one of your videos. I'm going to go look at it and I'm going to leave a comment and I'm going to subscribe to you. And just like God's gifted, I am going to uh, encourage you to make some more videos. And you know what you can do is, is that you can put, hey, even just a scripture a day about Jesus' love. Okay? Um, just pick out certain scriptures and just put it up there and read it. And um, just, you know, uh, send out blessings to everyone. And, uh, and that, that would be a, a, an awesome video for you to do. Uh, maybe you could do one little scripture every single day. Okay, so um, God bless you. I hope this helps you, sweetheart. Uh, and don't worry about the tribulation period. Don't worry about your family. Um, and don't worry about... Really, when it's getting ready to start, it, it may be very, very, very soon, though, according to the dreams and the visions of our brothers and sisters in Christ. Um, he's given us pieces to the puzzle. He's been giving us markers, like this will happen, then this will happen, then this will happen. And he's pushing us right along so that when the time does come, the people that are left behind that do not believe in Jesus at all, well, they can look at these videos and they go, wow, what these people were saying was true. Jesus is real. God is real. The tribulation is real. And um, this mark system, you know, where you take the beast, of, uh, the mark of the beast, which is the Antichrist, um, he's going to come as a man. And he's going to basically rule over Israel and his, at the whole world at this point. He's going to try to. And he's going to cause many to take his mark. And that will be in the right hand or in the forehead. And um, we're not going to be here during this. So you have absolutely nothing to worry about. Or your brother or your whole family because you're blessed in Christ. And you are in him, and he is in you and in your family, honey. So don't even worry about that. And um, But yes, I would like to encourage everybody to go over to Ashley Spitzer's channel. And please uh, subscribe to him. He is a young man. He is precious. He's a sweetheart, you guys, uh, in Christ. Uh, leave a comment for him. 
whatever you want to say, encouragement, prayer, whatever. Um, anything that's beautiful and loving towards him and his family, uh, that would be awesome. And subscribe to him, encourage him, uh, and uh, that would be that'd be great, you guys. But anyways, Ashley, God bless you, sweetheart. God bless your family. And God's gift. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm a big baby, y'all. <laughs> God bless you too, sweetheart. I, I I just so I'm so thankful for people like you that <laughs> you're reminding me of keeping the faith right now. Seven, she does the same thing when I'm not here or whatever. She'll she'll either put my links for me because my computer won't do it, and or she'll uh, she'll answer somebody um, or give encouragement and give awesome scripture. And I appreciate it. I really do, sweetheart. Um, Love and peace to both of you, and God bless the body of Christ. Amen and amen.